All right, it's a brand new year, and always folks want to get back into the groove and try to get back into an exercise routine. That's right. You can bet that the YMCA is pretty crowded today. That's where Tawanda is right now. Lots of folks keeping their New Year's resolutions today. Yes, the gym is full of gym goers, and it's so inspiring watching all these folks because sometimes you need a little extra motivation. We're here at the Donaldson Hermitage YMCA, where we've got some great tips on how you can stay motivated and get in shape once and for all. This is BJ Keener. She's the executive director here, and the gym is got a lot of motivated people in here this morning. Yes, it does. This is a great place, a great community to come and be fit together. So if people, maybe they don't want to join a gym, you've got right. some tips, whether you want to belong to a gym or not. Right. What can we do to stay motivated and, and take off the pounds or whatever this year? Right. Well, thanks for asking. I think the first thing is to have a plan. A lot of times it's the new year. People go, oh no, I need a resolution. I need to lose weight. And it's really about being healthy. So figure out where you're going, just like you would on a trip and plan accordingly. Taking some more steps, drinking more water, eating fruits and vegetables. Having a plan can help you when you get off course to get back on course and continue that journey of health and wellness. Do you recommend having someone like a buddy or someone to hold you accountable? I absolutely do. Having a buddy is amazing. The difference it makes for accountability when you have someone that you know is waiting on you or will be in class with you. Going to a Group X class is a great way to connect. The Y has a Better Together program where you can join with a friend and both benefit. So buddies are great. I think so as well. Now, uh, often we see the, you know, the 90-day club yes. come in. Yes. What can we do to stay motivated and still be coming, you know, three months, four right. months from now? Right. Well, beyond having a plan, it's changing your perspective. It's realizing the benefits to being healthy and that it's a journey, not a destination. So it's not about just when you lose that five pounds, it's about being healthier. And what are the ramifications? It's looking at, again, at where you're going and then figuring out, start small, start slow. Perhaps it's giving up one thing or just drinking more water, taking more steps. So slow and steady wins the race. Fantastic. Well, we've got lots more great tips. We're going to introduce you to a young lady who is a regular gym goer and who's got some more great tips for us. Thank you, BJ. Thank you.